you know, one bait I've almost always got tied on and sitting in my rod box is a Strike King popping perch. The cool thing about this bait is, is you can fish it in so many different situations, whether it's around light grass, heavy grass, you can fish it around wood cover, throw it up around rocks, you can fish it slow, you can fish it fast, hey, you can even throw it up around docks. That's a good one. That is so unbelievably awesome right there. What happened was, is on this very dock just a minute ago, I get a bite and he, the reason I'm throwing, you know, it doesn't look like the kind of place that you'd throw a popping perch. But the reason I was throwing it was, is, you know, sometimes skipping up under docks, you can't skip a hard bait under there, but a soft bait like this, you can sling it up under there. And I had a bite and I was sitting over there and I thought, you know, maybe I can get it way up under there. Got it way up under there, four and a half pounder. That's awesome. He chomped it. You know, with the cup lip the way it is, people think, well, hey, you need to just bloop this bait in. But there's a lot of different ways you can work it. In real heavy grass, the bait won't work side to side. So you've got to just fish it pretty slow, kind of pop it along. Out in open water, it can either be fast or slow. A lot of times walking it's the best way to do it. You basically got to give a little bit of slack each time to get it to walk really well back and forth. But when you look at it on the water, the way the tail flares out, it looks like a wounded perch. Exactly what the name is. Hey, popping perch will catch you a ton of bass.